outside in a damn G. Right outside, TT. Two turn, baby girl, you know me. Still with the dolls that I grew beside. All the niggas proud me, I and it guy. Gotta watch the time, cause it's flying right by. I'm outside in a damn G. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a deep clean with me. I know y'all love these. I love doing it. I love cleaning. It's just something that just makes me feel real, real good. So if you're new here, hey girl, my name is Akira Janae. Don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave. So <clears throat> it is currently 6.55 in the evening. It's Monday, January 8th. And I just got back home from being out shopping and all of that so um yeah that vlog i started a weekly vlog today as well and the weekly vlog will be posted this following sunday um so yeah this should be posted before the weekly vlog but anyways we're gonna be cleaning in this one um i just ate and i am literally so tired <laughs> i got up at like 11 it's about to be seven o'clock i want to be done cleaning by like 9 30 10 o'clock so i did go ahead and start cleaning um last night a little bit so i put this over this so you couldn't see but <laughs> i folded i did all of my laundry last night i folded all of my clothes so all of this this stuff needs to be hung up on hangers the rest of this stuff is already folded and then that's base stuff down there as well as i also went ahead and folded everything and i just put it in this basket so gonna take this in my room and be able to just fold everything um i wanted to kind of jump start cleaning because i knew like i know my cleaning days my cleaning days really take a while so that's why i'm trying to limit it oh that's why i gotta stop eating my bed why well, i just find a cheese it in the bed see mm -mm. <laughs> i'm done i'm done eating the bed i'm gonna go ahead and start washing my bed sheets y'all know this is something that i normally like to do I forgot to do this before I had left out and went shopping and stuff. So stay tuned for that vlog. It's supposed to be up after this one, but we'll see. So I'm going to strip my bed because this needs to be washed real bad. I just washed my like bottom sheet on my baseboard. So only other thing I'm going to wash is my fitted sheet and then all of my pillowcases. So washed all of my towels last night i didn't fold them but obviously i took them out the dryer so we do got to fold those right now we're going to go ahead and get into washing my bedding i like to use the oxyclean just started using this about two months ago you can literally use it for any and everything so i don't ever measure it out i just put some in there and i got a lot of laundry detergent for christmas so I'm gonna go ahead and use the rest of this little bitty gain one since I am washing all of my bedding. I'm literally gonna fill this up dang there to the max. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh, I almost dropped y'all. That would've been real bad. Like, real bad. Okay. Oh, Jesus. I better be done cleaning by 10 o'clock. I know that. 7, 8, 9, 10. I got three hours to clean up this whole freaking apartment and deep clean. This deep clean may be a little chaotic. <laughs> Not even going to lie to you, okay? Because I've just been doing so much today. All right, I'm going to put it on bedding. Slash waterproof is going to take an hour and 23 minutes. Go ahead and start that cool cool so we're gonna start in my room because i do have a new air purifier that i want to actually put up and keep in my room um obviously because i mostly spend most of my time in my room so i want the air purifier in here so we're gonna go ahead and clean my room first i normally usually do the kitchen first um because it's the it takes the longest but i don't really want to tire myself out especially because i just ate a really really big meal and i'm already kind of feeling 
you know, feeling a little sleepy. So my room isn't bad. Um, I just, my room isn't bad. So I feel like I can get done with my room and my bathroom and closet within like 30, 30 ish minutes it's 706 so by like 7 35 7 40 i would like to be done with my room so shouldn't take that long like i said i want to put my air purifier up in here as well we're gonna get into that i'm super excited about that because it's funny i literally saw i'll probably pop it right here i saw a girl post about the air purifier this air purifier is literally the exact same one that i freaking have so she um was lighting the bath and body works candles and then you, you you i'm gonna post it right here you can read the post pause and read okay so <laughs> that's just crazy like so that's why i'm super excited to put up this new air purifier to make sure that the air that's in here is good because y'all know i love them bath and body works candles like there's one right over there right now so i do need to start looking for some locally owned uh like black owned candle businesses or just just anybody who have a candle business that's non-toxic and stuff like that i would like to actually start using those as well as like the wall plugins all of that type of stuff it's just stuff like that just be costing a lot but you know we we, we gonna figure it out when i put this air purifier up we're gonna see how this area is so uh, i got all of my bedding and stuff off the next thing that i want to do is actually vacuum around my bed so there's like crumbs and just stuff around the bed that we're going to vacuum up and take these cheeses out so like all these little crumbs i was eating cheeses in my bed last night i know not to do that but we're about to go ahead and get it this all the way together and vacuum all of this up because you know what one day i'm gonna grow up and stop eating snacks in my bed because i am tired of this <laughs> vacuum is from Shein. i got two different ones sent to me and last i checked they were out of stock but if i could find if i could find it i'll link it spray down or distribute this pet fresh carpet odor eliminator um even if i didn't have a dog i would definitely still use this one because this one smells better than all the other ones i'm gonna go ahead and lay this down and let this kind of marinate y'all know how we do i'm gonna let this marinate for about like five ten minutes while i kind of clean up the bathroom and then we're gonna come vacuum and then i'm gonna put up my new air purifier Not a 
it's already 7.34. Who was I kidding? <laughs> I wanna go ahead and spray down my shower with the Pink Stuff Multi Cleaner. Um, and then I'm gonna let that sit while I unbox my new air purifier. So I'm super excited to open up my new air purifier. Um, <clears throat> I have my shower marinate right now <laughs> with all my cleaning solutions that I put in there. We're about to go ahead and unbox this. I'm super excited for this. I've been wanting an air purifier for a long time. This one has <clears throat> almost 2,000 reviews right now on Amazon and it's a 4.6 rating. So I'm super excited to try this out. I have the brand... Um, Morento or Morento, something like that. M O R E N T O air purifier. It's funny because y'all know I was just talking about <laughs> that lady who has said something about you know her using this in the Bath and Body Works candles and stuff. So I'm like, I cannot wait to freaking get this if it's actually you know like that accurate. And y'all know I'll be burning on Bath and Body Works candles so. I'm definitely about to put this to the test and we gonna see and like when I wake up and stuff tomorrow we're gonna see what it's talking about but I obviously want it in my room because like I said this is where I be chilling at most of the time and like this is where I sleep at night so I want this room to be you know in tip-top shape as so well. it's very quiet is why I want it in my bedroom it literally says that it's lower sounding than like dog barking and whispering so I'm super excited to try this out um and I want it in here. So let's go ahead and unbox her. I'm glad I got the white because I know it's gonna match with my decor really, really nicely. This is she, she's big, real, real hefty. Okay, ooh, what? All right, we got instructions flying everywhere. So in order to ensure the best effect, it is recommended not to put the air inlet, not to put the air inlet of the purifier close to the wall. Okay, note it, don't put it close to the wall. Don't make the PM 2.5 sensor occluded or close to the wall when the machine is running. Right at the top, it literally says, the filter is protected with the packing, with the packaging bag, unpack the filter before using. Please tear off the protection film before using. Make sure to tear this off. I remember seeing somebody um, <laughs> actually left this on. Like it wasn't this filter or anything. It was something to where they didn't unpackage this and literally left the plastic on there. That's literally insane. Go ahead and tear off the rest of this stuff. Okay, so I have my stuff connected. Right now it shows that I'm in Little Rock air purifier. Um, the air quality is at a nine or a 10. And on here it says it needs to be below a 28 for it to be excellent. And baby, we good over here, okay? <laughs> We're at a 10. So the other thing left that I have to do is since I got the app, I can control it. Even if I'm not at home, since I'm under the Wi-Fi, you can set schedules. You can check the air filter to life, set the timers, make day life customizations. And then it also collect, I mean, it also connects to Amazon Alexa as well. So I'll be setting that up maybe. And if you got a Google Home, which I do have as well, you can connect it to Google Home. So that's good that you can do Alexa and Google Home have the filter reset this is a timer child lock the on and off switch your wind speed sleep mode and auto mode i'm about to play around with the app a little bit so mode it has auto sleep 1f 2f 3f and 4f i have no idea what the f's mean <laughs> i think the 1f 2 3f's all of that i think that's the wind speed so i'm going to keep it at one 
and then we have countdown don't know what that is we got settings child lock reset the filter official website and then you can schedule and then right here that's the switch i believe is on and off so i just turned it off from my phone off and then i'm going to turn it back on from my phone since it said don't put it by a wall i'm not really sure where i exactly want to put this now because i was going to put it over there in the corner which that make it still work i think i'm going to do that hold on This would be a good spot for it because it's not completely up against the wall. It's like, you know, it got some space back there. It's kind of county catter cornered. But as y'all can see, it's showing 1615 now. Since I just moved it to the other side of the room, this is where I used to keep prints at. Like Prince Bay used to be over here. So I'm thinking that's probably why it's a little bit higher over here. But I'm gonna keep this in my room feels really good over here it looks really nice over here i'm super excited about this um i'll probably come back and pop on and show you where the number is at um after i get done cleaning but i'm super excited about this thank you so much morento for sponsoring this portion of the video and sending this out to me i cannot wait to just continue using this so i'm about to try to set it up to use alexa so it says to Go to the app, click me in the lower right corner, click Alexa, and link the Amazon Alexa. What's the air quality on the purifier? Air purifier, air quality is good. Period. <laughs> it says a lot of stuff that you can ask her. Alexa, what's the air pollution on the air purifier? Air purifier, air pollution is good. Alexa, what's the air purifier filter life? Air purifier filter life is 100. Period. So this is a list of all the things that you can ask her. Um, you can tell her to do a lot of stuff, ask her to do a lot of stuff. It's really litty over here. And right now it is on eight. I'm actually about to turn my fan off because I think the air purifier literally has it like even cooler in here. And it's been set up for about 30 minutes as well. And I was reading some of the reviews how they were like they can immediately tell the difference. I really feel like I can immediately tell the difference like it literally just went down to the number seven so like it's real lit up in here okay <laughs> I'm super excited about that I cannot wait to just put this all around my home but it also said I don't think I gotta really move it around because it said it can reach up to like a thousand and like 68 square feet and my apartment is like just that so i feel like it'll be able to reach everywhere in here so i'm going to keep it in my room for right now i may keep it in my room for about a week and since it is like a little bit bigger it is kind of off in the corner i may go ahead and put that in my guest room somewhere um just because exactly where i got the air purifier at right now is where i keep prince bed at so i'm going to keep it in here for about a week though and then i'll probably move it into like the living room or my guest bedroom or something like that so we're gonna continue cleaning um it's 8 23 hmm <laughs> my bedding should be just about done so what i'm gonna do is just finish up cleaning the bathroom and then we're gonna get into the kitchen and living room Funny to be That's why you think I left but one time 
got tired of your shit, you almost took my mind Long stay on the name Talking to you to try to play these games Leave your family in the booty man And I don't think you'll ever change your way Cause our house, it's not a home where no one stays So alone, no one stays Should I move on since no one's here? bedroom and my bathroom I'm just waiting on my bed sheets to finish drying so I'm about to start on my kitchen in my living room now it is nine o'clock on the dot so I am trying to get done with this within like a freaking hour
o'clock right now well it's 10 02 and i'm basically done cleaning everything the only thing that i got to do that's let me put up my chairs is i need to mop my floors i'm going to be using my little gadget that i showed y'all last month in my last deep clean with me so i'm going to be using this and then yeah we're going to mop the floors after i mop everything else will be done i'm going to clean the sink i got one dish in there to clean everything else is good I'm gonna also clean up Prince bowls, his water bowl and his food bowl. And I kinda don't want his food out like that anymore. Like it's gray, nothing's gray in here. We're all black, white, and silver. So I'm thinking of maybe hiding that in like one of my cabinets or something. But I mean, obviously I feed him every day so it's convenient to keep right there, but I'm tired of looking at it, if that makes sense. <laughs> so after I get done mopping, I'm gonna come in here and I'm gonna put up all of my clothes everything is washed they're all folded i just got to put them away my bedding is actually done so once i get done putting on my clothes away then i'll put my bedding on but i mean it's 10 what time is it it's 10 3 i feel like i did good time and like i said everything is clean it's just i just got to put my clothes away mop and then make my bed and we'll be done Working on a weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Someone hit the block up, I tell you if it was us. Man, a house in Rosewood, this shit too plush. Say my day's a number, but I keep waking up. Know you see my text, baby, please say something. Wine by the glass, man, a cheapskate, huh? Niggas gotta move on my release day, huh? Bitch, this is fame, not clout. I don't even know what that's about. Watch your mouth. Maybe got an ego twice the size of the crib. I can never tell the shit it is what it is. Said what I had to and did what I did. Never turn my back on every G, God forbid. Heard you got the paddock on my wrist, doing front flips. Giving you my number, but don't hit me on no dumb shit. Working on the weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist, going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Someone hit the block up, I tell you if it was us. In a house in Rosewood, this shit too plush. It's cool, man. Got red bottles on. Life is good. You know what I mean? I see bare man ducking and dive when I crash this spot, I'm trying to leave her bleeding. I'm sick and tired of the ski in back this time, I see bare man breezing. Ooh, your bro circle the sh with a sh, sound got dropped in the evening. Bad peas come down south with a D, but I ain't got a Jimmy, I ain't beating. Slap at a man on the back row, look to my right, see my ex in three and scream. So I'm done putting all of my clothes and everything away. I also did a little bit of organizing these are the socks that i still gotta find a match to and or throw away like this that's going in the trash um but i went through my sock drawer and these are like i had bought like a pack of y'all remember a pack of like 10 socks with this brand from like marshall's or somewhere but these are like regular socks and all of these in the back are like fluffy socks so yeah i also went through my shorts drawer I threw away the shorts that obviously I can't fit anymore because I'm in a size like four in pants now. So a lot of them shorts were like smalls and extra smalls and I can't fit them no more. This is like random little bitty like tank tops and shirts. I went through that and threw a lot of clothes away out of that. I'll show y'all my battery's about to die though. So right here, I threw away a lot. Like I threw away a lot of socks, a lot of shirts and y'all saw I threw away a lot of my underwear as well. Um, just old stuff that, you know, I've had for years. I'm not going to wear anymore. And, like, Prince had gotten some of my underwear as well and, like, ripped a hole in them. So, just, just stuff that needs to be thrown out. So, I'm super excited. My apartment is looking really, really good and smelling really, really good. It's literally 11, 14 at night. I'm about to switch out my battery so I can talk to y'all. Okay, so, switched out my battery. Turn off this. Yeah, so I just threw out a lot of stuff that I knew I wasn't going to wear. I haven't went through my actual, like, clothes yet, but I feel like 
Like all of this stuff I just recently got. Like I'm not throwing none of that out. If anything, it'll maybe be some of my winter stuff that like I don't wear anymore. Um, but honestly, like I don't really have any of the clothes to just throw out per se. Like I could still wear all of this stuff. And all of this stuff is pretty much fairly new and I have not worn yet. And just random little like tank tops and bodysuits. And especially all of this stuff. Like, all of this stuff is literally she in. <laughs> so, yeah. And I have no more hangers. Um, I have one, two, three, four right here. And then I have one, two, three, four. So, I have eight hangers left. Um, if y'all remember, I always go up. Oh, I always go to the at-home store and or Walmart or Target. Mostly the at-home store and buy a pack of, like, I don't know if it's 25 or 50 but y'all i also went on amazon and bought a lot of packs of hangers if only y'all knew how many hangers i have up in here like it's definitely about 250 hangers and obviously this isn't even all my clothes like the rest of my clothes y'all know i have this storage so all the rest of my clothes are obviously in here this side that side and the other side and then y'all know i got so many clothes up in my drawers as well so i'm probably gonna have to go to the at home store tomorrow um i need to get my nails done tomorrow go to the at home store i need some hangers um because y'all know if y'all just watched my last vlog i just did a clothing haul these are clothes that I bought with my own money from Shein, but I do have another collab coming from them. And they're literally sending me like $150 worth of more clothes. <laughs> so I'm going to need some more hangers. Um, at this point, I hope I don't run out of space. Obviously, if my closet do get too packed, then y'all know I got a too bad, too bad. Like literally, there's nothing in here. So I can just put the rest of my clothes in here. This is literally just like another storage closet. And I need to go throw out them pillows. I've been trying to keep them for like if company and stuff come over. But I mean, I have company every probably six months, maybe. Someone other that's not my boyfriend. But anyways, I wanted to show y'all that these pillows. Y'all know when I went and bought these pillows from home goods it's the Sealy brand s-e-a-l-y these are so freaking soft but sometimes i do be wanting a firm pillow so these are really really soft but they're not too firm so i had these left over as well i think these are from big lots if i'm not mistaken i can't even find the brand yeah s-e-r-t-a cetera this is big lots brand and that is too hard like i don't know they just be too tough so this is also another cetra brand but these are the cooling pillows that y'all know i had bought from walmart that they definitely feel cool but when i put them into a pillowcase they don't have that same cooling effect but these are a little bit softer than those you can even kind of tell it's just like flat so i'm going to switch back into these and then as well as keeping these i may end up buying some more pillows from home goods because it seems like home goods is the only place to where i can really just find pillows that i absolutely love so yeah we're about to make my bed prince over here chilling i moved his bed from over here because i got the air purifier and it's still working really well we're on nine in here so that's good Okay, so it is 11 44 
at night. <laughs> I've been taking a few breaks. Um, it really only took me about four hours, and obviously, if I if I wasn't recording, I feel like I could have got done in three hours. But I'm done now, so I'm gonna show you guys the finished product and whatever else is not clean. Then we're just gonna finish tomorrow. My room is clean. Bed is made. Put my glasses back on. Room is clean, bed is made, everything's vacuumed, which I'm about to mess the bed back up. I'm about to go ahead and turn off this light. She's looking real nice. Got my little air purifier over here. It's on 12 right now. My mirror, we cleaned that. I normally don't ever really honestly use this mirror, but when she's clean, she definitely looks good. I feel like I might would like to mount this mirror just to give it a little bit more height because yeah I'm not really caring for that but yeah everything's over here clean vacuumed I guess I'm gonna keep this little bed right here um the bathroom is clean toilet's good I already did a deep clean on the toilet so that's why I didn't clean too much on that this is all clean I gotta still switch that out I'm about to take a shower and put this on right now other than that, shower's good. My closet's good. I just put this right here, sweatpants and stuff. I'll probably pop that on tomorrow. Everything is in place. Whew, girl, I'm tired. I'm about to close these up because I learned that when these are open, my bathroom becomes negative 10 degrees. So when I close them, it doesn't allow cold air to come because I told Bay to close that vent up there. But this one is still open, but I don't know. It'd just be really cold if I don't close that up. So bathroom's good. This is some new stuff you guys will see in my vlog, but I do need to put my new hamper up. So that's all new stuff. Prince toys over there. Everything's clean in here. That's the new trash can. You guys will see that in the vlog. I'm about to switch over into the vlog in a second and show that clean in here as well. That was never dirty. I need to actually dump this out while we're talking about it. So this is all the dirty water from my mopping. But yeah, everything's clean. I need to just put my air fryer up and it feels so much better. That's trash by the door. I didn't do my guest room in my guest bathroom i didn't clean in here either because yeah i'm tired and it's just gonna get back a mess tomorrow but for the most part i mean i swept and everything it's not bad i just gotta put my mess away from me doing my hair but i'm about to empty this out real quick jesus Ooh, look at all that hair and stuff yuck and this would be on the floor girl mm -mm. disgusting so what i started to do with this to make sure it's really clean i do have an actual brush to um clean this thing out but before i actually do that i'm gonna set this in the sink because i still gotta clean my sink i'm gonna spray some disinfectant in there because it kind of has a smell if you will and obviously we don't want it to stink get moldy and then i like to pour a little bit of bleach in here and then i'm going to pour a little bit of water in here as well i'm going to spray this and then i'm going to clean this tomorrow i like to let this sit to really air this out sometimes i put dishwashing liquid sometimes i don't but the bleach and Lysol would definitely be enough. And then I just shake it around a little bit. And that already smells a thousand times better. I'm gonna add more water, a little more bleach. And then just let this sit. Depending on when I go to bed, sometimes I let it sit overnight. Sometimes I go ahead and wash it out, but I'm extremely tired. So we're just gonna let this sit for a little bit. And then I need to clean out 
my sink as well. And yeah, that's pretty much it. My apartment's clean. Everything's clean, everything's smelling good. I don't have any more wall plugins and stuff like that, but I'm kind of glad because since I do got the air purifier, um, and that other girl said that, you know, like all the toxic stuff just messes up your ear. So I would like to try to find some that's non-toxic. Um, but yeah, don't forget to like this video, comment, subscribe. I'm going to end it out here. Thank you so much for cleaning with me. All the links and everything will be down in the description box for the air purifier, my um, vacuum, like just everything. I always have everything linked down below in the description box. So until my next video, I will see you lovelies then. Bye guys.